Good morning and welcome back to the channel. We're at Spot Y this morning. The wind's blowing cross shore, it's a bit bumpy. It's just stopped raining, it's pretty cold. I've got my spring suit with me if I do want to go out. There's the tractor just sweeping the beach. There's one guy that's uh, just paddled out, I had a bit of a chat to him. Like he said, it's be the last surf of the year. It's uh, New Year's Eve tonight, so I think we're going to put an end to this, this horrible year. I'm just deciding what to do. Have I, got the, have I got the energy to go out there in that slop or not? I really don't know. I'm so tempted to go and look somewhere else just to get back in the car and put the heater on, which is insane at this time of year in Australia. I'll just watch this guy and see if he actually catches anything. No, you missed that one. He's on a big board too, which makes a huge difference. There are a couple of little waves coming through over here, but just closing out really. There's no shape to any of them. Well, at least we're getting a little bit of pink in the sky anyway, nothing else. It's quite a picturesque vista that. You've got the ship in the background, you've got the pier and the headland behind it. And uh, the beginnings of a sunrise. I, don't, I think the cloud cover is going to uh, make a pretty ordinary sunrise, but you never know. This guy hasn't caught anything. I might go for a walk up to the point there and view the sunrise from there. I'm still not an enthusiast enough to get wet right at the moment, but uh, I'd only need to see one reasonable wave and that might change. Well, at least I'm going to see the sunrise, if nothing else. I still haven't seen this guy out that's out here catch a wave, but... It does look good over the pier, I have to admit. Against my better judgment, I'm going out for a paddle. I'm not really looking forward to it, but it's the last surf of the year. Got to make the most of it. Oh, there's one. I have to go down where the young Chris is, I think.
safe. Well, it's done. I'm going to get the 7.4 version of this. And then I've got two. Yeah, I'm struggling big time on this. join me on a journey to somewhere quite exciting I'm going down to a surfboard shop and I'm going to look at another board not to replace the uh, six foot seaside but to uh, complement it hopefully because at the moment with the, the low quality waves that we're getting I'm struggling to catch anything so I'm thinking a bigger board along similar lines might be the answer we're just driving alongside um, lovely scenic Lake Macquarie we'll see when we get there well here we are we've arrived at the uh, I'm going to have a look at another board. Let's go and see what we can find. And there we have it, people. The new board next to the Civic Thai Bar. Now, I'm, I'm not going to reveal what it is. That'll be tomorrow morning. Um, it's a little bit bigger than the 6.0, as you can clearly see. Um, yeah hopefully this will be a transition i'll be able to ride uh, either one or the other uh, the idea is my mate noel who's heaps light, lighter than i am younger much more athletic he's only 63 kilos he can take the um he can take the 60 out by a wire and i can take this one out and we can just swap over at some point during the day and i can try and get a couple of waves depending on the condition because that's the key to it I think is the conditions so I'm gonna end it uh, end it there you'll have to wait I'm sorry you have to wait for tomorrow's video video for the reveal don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and we'll catch you on the next one